Welcome back, Roadie Footy fam. Live from, dang, are we in Georgia or South Carolina right now? I think we're technically in South Carolina. So guys, uh, do me a favor, like, comment, share, subscribe. Also, uh, well, I'll be remembering, uh, reminding you guys the whole month of November, whole month of December. Holiday Hope Drive, if you can donate 5, 10, 20 bucks, whatever it is. If you can't, share the Holiday Hope Drive uh, link down below. It's uh, to a GoFundMe page. Thank you so much to the folks that have donated. We have a, a goal of 500. I think we have 120 or 150 already donated. So thank you, Brody Foodie fam. So my buddy Adam is an absolute, unapologetically, oh, I said that right without messing it up, uh, Waffle House fiend. So he told me, this is how you're going to order it, Loop. You're going to get a Texas bacon, egg, and cheese with extra bacon, add tomato, side of cheesy grits, and a side of sausage with gravy on it. I don't know if this is good to eat while on the road. This is going to make me sleepy. The South has a bunch of food that just makes you sleepy. It's nappy time all the time. All right, fam, let's do the cheesy grits up in the city first. Mm. Oh, yeah. Yeah, cheesy grits, baby, old deck. Look at this, sausage patty. Let's move this over. Sausage patty with gravy on top. This I already know is gonna be, I'm not even gonna cut it, I'm just gonna eat it. Mmm. Sausage and gravy and grits. I will say that I don't eat as much grits as I want to, and I should. Now, let's go ahead and try this without the mayo, Adam. Look how much bacon. Adam, and I read it to them exactly how you said it. Oh, that's good bacon, man. So basically like a BLT. Mmm. But instead of the instead of the the lettuce, it's an egg. Add cheese. All right, let's do a mayo style. Mayo is one of those things that will change a whole dynamic of something. And I love mayo. All right, Adam, here we go, buddy. And for you, oh my God, what is that? It's just a fly. <laughs> and for all you weirdos out there that don't like mayo, stop it. Stop it. It's just egg whites and oil. That's all it is. Egg whites and oil. But guys, every single from, I would say... Probably Maryland, Maryland, maybe DC area and South. There's a Waffle House literally at every freaking junction. And I will say the cheap, uh, the cheap, the gas was getting cheaper down, down the line, except for when I just hit this stop right now in South Carolina for some reason. Mm. But it was one of those things where I was like, I was already on one side of a street. I wasn't going to turn around to get 10 cents cheaper. I would do that at home. But on the road, you're like, let's just do it. About some... Whatever, I don't know how they're making the bacon this crispy.
Adam, I'm assuming that you're eating this when you have nothing else to do with the for the day. I think I, I think I still have like five, six hundred miles to go. I've done that. Mm. This is good, like by itself. But you guys know me; I like to mix up flavors. Yo, you gotta get out of here, buddy. You gotta get your own Waffle House. Hmm. Also, another place that I haven't, I've never eaten at, that I saw a lot on the exits was a place called Bojangles. Does anybody know what the heck Bojangles is? And what do they serve there? I will say, like, 95, it's really... It's like these really obscure little motels that are everywhere. And you're like, who the heck is staying in these? Because I never see anybody like in the parking lot. How are how these places making money? Either that or it's just like weekend warriors. Mm, I think I like the... Yeah. The breakfast of champions right here. Guys, let me know what your go-to breakfast is at Waffle House because I think I want to try everybody's. And Adam, I hope that I order this the right way, brother. If I didn't, my bad. The lady was looking at me like she understood what I was saying, but also the whole time with the with the people behind the grill, they were like modifying a bunch of stuff. So this must be like a super modified thing here. I do feel kind of ready to hit the road though. Mm. But yeah, guys, everything, after you leave, um, like, the the Baltimore, D.C. area, and you're taking 95 South all the way down. Why does that look red back there? That's kind of cool. There is literally nothing. And I'm not saying, like, there's nothing out here. But the way that 95 is situated, there's like nothing on the sides. It's all rest stops, all of it. Whereas, you know, up north a little bit, it's, um, there's like cities and stuff like around the freeway. Mm. That gravy is where it's at. And I also need to know what the hell, um, what was the other thing that I see? Chucky's? I feel like Chucky's or, or Shorny's? No. There was a couple of them. And I did, um, so I took a shower at a Planet Fitness last night. But I will be making a separate video, guys, just to let you know. Um, so, you know, in middle America or in the Americas where there's a lot of trucking. And obviously, I was driving all hours of the day and night. I'd just been taking power naps. 
here and there. Last night I got like six hours, but it wasn't good six hours of sleep. It was more like five. Um, they have these like super huge uh, uh, gas stations where they accommodate trucks as well. And one of my favorites is just, it's called Love's. And it's just, it's called, I just like the name Love's. Uh, there's also, um, I can't wait to actually go to a Bucky's. I want to go to one of the huge Bucky's. We might do a live from there. But um, they do showers for truckers, but anybody can buy a shower. They're like, depending on 8, 10, 12 bucks maybe, depending on the location. And uh, I'm going to do a video, guys, on how to take a shower at a Love's or uh, any other variation of it. I think that'll be kind of a cool video. All right, let's finish this off. I gotta hit the road. Mm. It's a good breakfast, he wasn't lying. He wasn't lying. Mm. Although I would have loved a little more cheese in my grits. But we're not going to start a war over it. Again, guys, let me know what your favorite um, Waffle House meals are. Uh, again, please do me a favor. Uh, if you can't donate, if you can share the GoFundMe to your social medias or, you know, if you know someone um, who... Uh, is looking to you know to donate or something like that uh share the link with them um how a home on wheels alliance is an amazing organization you guys i don't want to i don't want you guys to get tired of me talking about it but it's it's pretty important to not only to us but to this channel uh to me personally i kind of connected with the the mission statement especially since we're kind of living this car life van life nomadic lifestyle it just makes sense and this is going to be an annual thing. We'll 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 pick a different charity every year, um, but yeah, Roadie Foodies first annual holiday hope drive. All right, guys, I love you so much. Like, comment, share, subscribe. Again, share that GoFundMe uh, link down below, and we're out, we're off to Florida, baby. I've never been to Florida. Can we talk about that? I have so many people in New England that basically live in Florida half the year. And then you have me who has gone internationally. I've been all over the U.S., but I've just never been to Florida. So when this opportunity came up, I was like, yeah, we're, 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 we're going to smash down a little Florida action. Uh, but I got to hit the road, guys, because I am behind a couple hours. I, I want to make it there on time uh, to do some things. Uh, again, uh, like, comment, share, subscribe. Be well, eat well, and take care of each other. Ciao.